the California Lightworks 550 with the supplementary UVB light, and I don't want to kill my shit. Any advice on how to best use the UVB light? That's an interesting question because I'm wondering if you think you're going to kill your shit with the UVB light. So here's the thing, right? So they, they talk about, oh, LEDs talk about, oh, how you got to get the blurple or you got to get the this or the that spectra fucking whatever the, they're, they're trying to sell you. These guys are trying to sell you UVB. So here's a couple of UVBs. Yo, you don't got to worry about killing your plants with the UVB. That ain't going to be the thing. These things are like, that's 15 watts, right? There ain't nothing. You could grow a clone with these two UVBs. So there ain't nothing about these two UVBs that you have to worry about. Now, that said, the benefit of UVBs, they talk about trichomes, whatever, man. Smoke some wax. Who cares if you use an LED? It's 90% THC, who cares? Okay. So if you're asking me, and, and I say that because I have a California Lightworks, 550 with the supplementary UVB light and I don't want to kill my shit. I don't want to kill my shit. How do I use the UVB? So I'm not sure if you're ass associating the UVB with the killing your shit, but I will tell you that anytime you have an LED, it should be five feet away. Any of real LED, not, not the, not your Mars, not, not your Mars. I mean, even your Mars should be far away, but not your 200 watt Mars LED, 1200 watt Wu Chung, you know, 200 watts at the wall, 1200 Wu Chungs on the box. Not that. So this thing here has the UVB as well. I'll tell you with anything else with an LED, like any LED, always put them farther away or use a narrower, longer, which is a rectangle, or use a rectangle grow area and put them on a light rail light mover. Always move your LED. LEDs are always too close. It's, it's almost a problem. It, it, it is a problem to grow with an LED in a seven foot tent. Uh, I would raise the light and add silica. You should always be adding a little bit of silica. Once a month, you should put silica in a bucket. Once a month, you add some silica. But definitely raise the light. I mean, you could dim it or raise it. Um, what's up, no one? Boss, do you like 24 hours for seedling or what is best for seedlings? Seedlings and clone, anything in the rooting stage, 24 hours of light. Seedlings and clones, anything in the rooting stage, 24 hours of light. Uh, veg, 18.6. Could you do 24 hours? Yeah. But, uh, you don't get more light, you don't get more growth. And if you get more plant growth, you don't get more root growth. Why don't you get more root growth? Because during the photo dark period, I already told you the answer to this. During the photo dark period, the plant takes the sugars that she made during the day and transports them down to the roots for storage, for, for later. So next year she can send a shoot up again. Going great, just finished trimming. Um, oh, there's so many comments. Uh, hit that like button. You know, it's funny because, because if you look at what's, I'm gonna tell you the difference between, between me and the other channels that, that grow weed. I have, I, I just, I don't ask, I don't, there's no reason for me to do the likes thing. Sometimes Chuck handles the likes thing for me. Do it, Chuck. Hit that like button. <laughs> or the thumbs up button. Oh, the thumbs up. Damn it. Wait a minute. Which one? Thumbs up. Whatever. 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 <laughs> and <laughs> you caught me with that too. And so, uh, you know, hit the thumbs up. No, it's thumbs up. Like button's on Facebook. Okay. So you don't see me. You don't see me worrying about the likes. I, I, none of that stuff is relevant to me. I don't care if you like my style. I don't care if you like the way I present the information. I am not here for you to like. What am I here for, Chuck? Hopes and dreams. I am here to
to sell you hopes and dreams. God, that's like half true. I am here to teach you how to stop killing your cannabis plants. That's all I'm here to do. And I frankly, I don't want you to like me. I, I don't want you to like me. I don't want you calling the store and trying to talk to me. I don't want you sending emails. I don't want you, you know what I mean? Like I'm happy to answer questions, but I, I just delete all your guys' shit. I, I don't, I mean, I may save it for the show, but I don't ever respond. And that's not true. There, that's not true. There are a few people that you just have to respond to. There are some people that are hurting and in pain and you have to stop and take a moment because of the responsibility of what I do. But for most of you, <laughs> oh, in military, you always have to stop for military because because I should have went in the military. You should have went in the military. And so I recognize that now that I'm older. Um, and so I stopped for that too. Um, and so there's a couple of medical and military things that you have to stop for just because I'm human. You know what I mean? And